So we're finally getting a new Dragon Ball movie. And the fact is, we're not just excited that it's new Dragon Ball movie, but it's because new Dragon Ball content, let it be a series or a movie. It has been three years since Dragon Ball Super ended. Actually, over three years. And then we got the Broly movie at the end of 2018, if I remember correctly, or towards the end of 2018. So, the way I see it is that they released the first trailer after the teaser came with like a month and a half or something. And I think that the trailer shouldn't be perfect. It shouldn't look actually like the movie is gonna be. Because the way I remember it, like, yes, I know this is a different topic, but if we're going to bring out uh, the teaser for the Super Dragon Ball movie Broly that we had in 2018, some people, like, believe it or not, although the animation was so fluid, I believe that many people agreed on that, if not everyone, but believe it or not, not everyone liked the art. The way I see it is that we can judge the trailer for what it is. It's just about you giving it time and, you know, just waiting to watch the whole thing to decide. I think that trailer did not look bad, it did not look absolutely horrible like some people think. Uh, did it look like a Xenoverse or Fighters uh, DLC? Yes, it did. But probably would look good. There are many factors that make a movie a good one or a bad one. Number one thing for me is always the story, because the story has to be great. However, for the Dragon Ball fans, I believe that if you give them fluid animation in the fights and strong opponents and all of that, people are going to be really excited for this, the majority of the people at least. One of the things I'm really excited about is Pan and about the way that I believe she's training with Piccolo. So this is going to be amazing, Piccolo is just going to be, you know, the godfather or something, the way he always was, starting with Gohan, going to Golden Trunks, and now with Pan, he's basically going to be a father to all the Saiyans yet to come. I really love this, it's kinda adorable actually. I'm also excited for Broly being there. Like, since I started the trailer, I was like, oh, a new Dragon Ball movie. Okay, let's let's see Broly. We want to see Broly right there, because I believe that many people just want to see Broly so badly. It's really exciting, it will show off uh, both Pan and Broly, and I hope we can see some fight scenes. Of course, we don't want Pan to fight a major villain, because it will be child abuse. So, either way, I'm just excited to see how the movie goes. Of course, feel free to agree or disagree on that. And, uh, yeah, what are your thoughts? Please feel free to leave them in the comments below. Thank you for watching. Have a great day, everyone.